So ladies and gentlemen, fight number eight this evening is an amateur flyweight bout which will be contested over three three-minute rounds. And introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he weighed in at 57.2 kilos and trains out of Southside MMA, holding an amateur record of five wins, three losses and one draw. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Navid, the Afghan Prince Hassan Zada. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he weighed in at 56.7 kilos and trains out of Mac One Fight Club, holding an undefeated amateur record of five wins and zero defeats. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Frank the Tank Jankowski. And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Diego Consoni. I don't think Diego's uh, mic'd up, but uh, this is his first uh, bout for tonight. Diego Consoni, very experienced referee. And this fight Ready? proudly Ready? brought to you by Engage. Engage is dedicated to providing all levels of athletes with the best possible tools to push the limits for the evolution of combat sports. And I can't wait for this one. This one's going to be a, a really good one. Yeah, Diego Consoni, the referee, first hitting. Uh, tremendous beat of a black belt, so he knows the grappling game. Frank Jankowski. Take on Naveed Hassan Zada. And as we said, uh, he just, he will fight anyone. Only his style, very welcoming. Frank Jankowski likes to keep it very technical, very disciplined when they engage. Look, don't get mistaken either. Flyweights, but these boys can hit hard. They will go to war. A bit of distance uh, shown by uh, both fighters, so they're both weary of one another. Well, Frank's got some power around him. You don't get the tank as a nickname for no reason. <laughs> and uh, Hassan Zada likes to throw those sorts of kicks he's very loose with his stand-up style that karate sort of background so frank the tank has a lot of support here at hbf stadium tonight perth boy you got a muay thai record of, of six and oh you got to be wary of of, of these kicks uh, the afghan prince also a purple belt as we said but jankowski likes to keep it disciplined oh. As I said that. Switching stances there is the tank. Oh, Jankowski. Heavy, heavy kicks. Another oh, heavy kick. Jankowski, another beautiful oh. heavy kick. Naveed Hassan Zada catching that, looking to do some damage, but Jankowski just knowing when to call it quits and get out of there. Oh, they're there nicely. Ooh. Oh, hands behind the back. Naveed Hassan Zada. <laughs> he doesn't want to do that because he gets caught with an elbow, accidental elbow, I might add. You've got to be careful with that. You've got to love the confidence, but uh, Frank Jankowski has some, some heavy hands and heavy feet. Looking for a guillotine, but it's a... Uh, oh, he's way too high on that. Yeah, exactly. It's more of a holding position right now. And he's trying to drop his weight, though, now to actually turn it into something. So he can turn it around. And that's actually a really smart decision by Hassan Zada. He's trying to fight the, the hand grips to know if he wants to commit to it, if he wants to pull guard, if he wants to keep it standing. He's turning it. That oh. is looking good. He has used it to get top control. Great move by the Afghan Prince. That is a, that is a high fight IQ move right there by oh. Hassan Zada. And he's, he's hanging on to that, that guillotine. And he stepped through. He's got that arm trapped. That is looking very, very good. Jankowski. Jankowski's in a, a tough position right now. He's trying to fight he's it. Up, up. What's happened here? And Diego Cassiani thought uh, that Jankowski was out. Stop. Stop. And time. That, time. Oh, no, he can't. That fight, the fight is over. I, he I, was out. He I was guarantee out. He you. was out. He wasn't moving. I guarantee oh, you. Oh, no, the controversy. I guarantee you the fight is over. Look, when a referee makes a call, Whatever it is, whatever it is, wasn't when a referee makes a call, he wasn't fortunate. And the he fight wasn't stopped. Fortunate. Here we go. Diego's mic'd up. He's explaining that uh, he believed the fighter was out. Safety is paramount, but uh, but he does look all right. He has Jankowski. He wasn't conscious. He was the move. He collapsed. And referee going back with. Uh, and then he got up in three seconds. Jankowski's corner. It's over. The fight's over. The referee has called the fight. 
crowd don't like it, but uh, it'll be interesting to see the replay here and uh, see whether the referee Diego Consoni has uh, made the right call. But Frank the Tank Jankowski clearly not happy. But here we go. Here's the replay. What can you see, Mitchell? I don't know, mate. You got to, You're not in that. You're not in that cage. It's, it is easy to to say what you see, but that referee in the cage uh, is obviously only looking for the best interest of a fighter. Jankowski popped up straight away. I mean, that does happen. But I think Jankowski's saying, oh, I'll love the rematch straight away. I'll have it now if I want, but, uh, if you want. But uh, the corner of Jankowski is absolutely Why vivid. is no Here one in the cage right now? He has called the fight. Here we go. Regardless of the result. Look, look. Your hands loose. Your hands loose. Look, his arm was loose. This? No yeah. action. No action. No action. Look, he does pop back no up, action. but... Look. It's over, it's over. Very... Someone get in the cage. He's called the it's fight. It's over. It's over. The fight's over. The fight's been over. So, so ladies and gentlemen, our referee has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes and 50 seconds of round number one. Declaring your winner by submission due to a guillotine choke in the blue corner. Now the Afghan Prince Hassan Zah.